God dang it! Why can't you make sure that no people break into our building, even though you are not our security staff in any sort of way and you are actually uh, considered to be out there doing field work? How dare you! World's best boss. <laughs> Time to brew some coffee. And then we're passing it! I have no use for napkins. I said we're passing it! That won't work. Okay, we don't pass in it. Time to get yelled at. Here's your coffee. Thank you. In what new way have I pissed you off this time? I distinctly remember asking for both you and Miller. Ugh, never mind. That's not I just bad. hope you haven't That's forgotten ugh. that he is your partner. No, I haven't. I wish he okay. wasn't. Now tell me what happened tonight. The perp entered, I assume, through the garage. Claire already filled me in. I want to know what happened outside. I pursued the perp with the 4x4 into the alleyway. He climbed up a fire escape to the rooftop. When I got up there, he gave me a surprise blow to the shoulder with a 2x4. He got away through the other fire escape. Shots fired? Yes, one. Any leads so far in the case? Besides what the next victim looks like? No, not really. We're not sure of that. He's wearing a toy and clothes. How high can it be? To to is that it? Because I'd like to get back to work now. Consider yourself on probation. What? Why? I've seen it before. Agents get too involved in their case and lose it. I'm losing it now? I think you're just pissed because we look like schmucks on the news. It's all about image, isn't it? No, this is about your recent behavior. I'm worried about the progress of the case and I think you need a break. This is bullshit. You're only proving my point. You know, Browning? I usually get kissed before I get fucked. <laughs> Best line ever! <laughs> uh, I need to remember that one. So, is everything okay? Not really. I'm on probation and he'll probably take over the case. Oh crap. I'm sorry. It's okay. Been there, done that, and bought the t-shirt. Hey, so what happened downstairs? We think the killer broke into the morgue and left us a picture of the next victim. You're kidding, right? I kid you not. A bold SOB, I'll give him that. You should go down and take a look at the picture. Claire needs to do a few tests on it and send it off to the labs. How do you get blood off a picture? Do you think it's safe to go down Watch there? Watch it! Doesn't sure it out the picture? I don't know. Okay, I'll go have a look. No, of course it doesn't. It comes from fucking... Never mind. What's this big lead you were telling me about? I did what you asked. I correlated the info on victims 4 and 5. Why do you have an action figure on the table? I got something, but it may be nothing. Try me. You've said that the last two victims probably knew our perp because he covered their face. Well, I got a name that's common to both victims. A Vaklav Kolar. Also, I tried linking this guy Vaklav. to victims 1, 2, and 3, but no go. How did you get the name Vaclav Kolar? I read Claire's report on the fifth victim. In it, she added a picture that was found in the victim's purse. On the picture, there was the victim, a girl, and a guy. The guy reminded me of someone. He's actually one of the people I interviewed for the fourth murder. He was her tutor at the university. I went back to read my own report, and it's the same guy. I'm sure of it. So, to the Any university? relationship between the fourth and fifth victims? As far as I can tell, they didn't know each other, but they had this guy in common. Maybe he deserves a second interview? Definitely. He I'll deserves a boot to the He's ass. seen you before, so it might make things go smoother, make him less nervous. Okay, and I'll give Kolar a visit. I sent the address to your 4x4's Navcom. If I have the chance, I'll go interview the latest victim's friends. Well, Maybe I can talk <laughs> to the other girl on the photo. Good idea. So, I need to go and seduce a... Uh Tutor? Should be easy enough to show that. What's this? Pro 
properly in my files. Let's report. Witnesses, Chicago Police Department Detective David Miller was present at the beginning of the autopsy. Probably not that. The car of death is drive of yeah, that's probably all the shit that we were picture taken on the fifth crime scene. Thank you. Oh, oh, uh huh. Uh, uh, okay. Well that's everything we already know, so that was completely pointless. So let's go out and do some wet work. I know she's pressing the button. Uh, fuck, I always forget B2. What makes sense seeing the more. No! God fucking damn it. Sorry! Could it just ride garage at B1? And I suppose I don't have to look for clues that that guy dropped or something. Okay, so there's one new location. It's the campus. <laughs> oh, wait, it's American flag. No one. Hey, girl. Okay. Uh, so it's up. I love what you have done with your hair. Uh, okay, there's only one door, so... Back love! You sound like an STD. Who is it? Agent McPherson, FBI. I have a few questions I'd like to ask you, if you have the time. I have time for the pretty agent. May I come in? Why don't you come in and slip into something less? I mean, something more... Uh... Hey, sorry I asked. What? what? Oh, nothing. Just thinking out loud. Oh, okay. <laughs> Would you like to watch my Star Wars collection? Did you know a Natalie Kenworth? Yes, I did. So I imagine you also know that she was murdered about a month ago. Yes, and I already talked to a police officer about her. Yeah, I know, but I would appreciate well, it. Would you want to watch you. it? How did you know Dr. her? A friend? Just a classmate? Yeah, I like Were you intimate? Dude, I was her tutor. She was studying in criminology, and I was helping her with some of her classes. She came here often. I was helping her, if you know what I mean. A student in criminology, huh? Did you ever get Professor Pratt? No, but I know him. I've had several conversations about weird unsolved cases. Does he still have bad B.O.? B.O.? body odor. In other words, he stinks. <laughs> yes, he still does. He's very disgusting. But then again, I touch myself. <laughs> Do you know Cynthia Woods? Cynthia Woods? No, I don't think so. Are you sure? Maybe a photo would help. Oh, yes, I have seen her before. She's my neighbor. Please say that wasn't the picture of her, her in a <laughs> fucking bathtub. was taken there. So you're not close to Cynthia? No, she's more my neighbor's friend. I think I saw her twice in all, at the party and once in the hallway. Uh, why? She was found brutally murdered in an abandoned apartment building. You don't think that... Hey, I'm always in here working on my thesis. I never go out. I, I went to Mia's party because she invited me. I think she invited me so I wouldn't complain about the noise. I don't care how very often. Mia's the other girl in the picture? Yes, she's my neighbor. She usually deserves me without unchi unchi music when I'm fabbing. It's very distracting. Your thesis, what's the subject? I'm doing it on a serial murder case called the Perlovka Ripper. It happened in the late 20s. Well, you don't say. Are you familiar with the case? You could say that, yes. Hmm, it all ties together. Do you mind if I take a look at it? Sure, I'll even print you up a copy. Okay. But then you will have to see now? with me. Sure, I'll be right back. Now 
is my chance. I should swipe something to get prints. It's not a sample of semen that I want, but fingerprints. <laughs> it's funny because it's porn. He would notice that missing. I don't want to get nailed on entrapment. Uh. Too risky to take that. This will do nicely. Here you are. Thanks a lot. I'll be sure to read it. I'd really appreciate your input if you ever have the time. Will do. You're not planning on leaving the country. No. Fine. Thanks for your cooperation and I'll keep in touch. I only plan to go to Asia. I've heard they got food cars down there. I'm really being a dick to this guy. So I need to lift some prints of this spear bottle. Hello? Hey, it's me. What's up? Nothing much. I was just calling to say I was on my way to visit what are you wearing? my roommate. Maybe she can tell us more about Vaclav and the other girl in the picture. No need, I know who she is. She's Vaclav's neighbor. Actually, I just finished the interview. How did it go? He's harmless. Anyways, he doesn't fit the profile. But I did nick a little something with Prince. I'm taking it over to Claire for I'm just going to say this out loud in front of uh, one of the people he checks there. Out. I know. Call me if you get anything interesting out of the roommate. Will do. Bye. Bye. Why is he just sitting there? I can't even talk to him. Anyway, some lap work. Why do I need this scene? It's not like I can click anything else. 